And we begin tonight with breaking news. Several young people are taken to Children's Hospital, crashing a stolen vehicle on Milwaukee's south side. It happened at 11th and Madison, and that's where we find our Sam Kramer live tonight. Sam, witnesses say they actually jumped in to help. Yeah, hi there, guys. This crash actually happened about 6.30 tonight, and it left a minivan that was traveling west on Madison tipped on its side. It was actually right here where you can still see debris tonight, shards of broken glass and others tucked along the curb. We just got some details preliminarily from Milwaukee police. I want to show you some video of what we had earlier. Police tell Fox 6 that this minivan, which was stolen and driven by a teenager, was traveling westbound on Madison between 50, 60 miles per hour. That Part, according to witnesses, when it blew the stop sign and collided with a sedan headed north on 11th Street. I'm told uh, there were three other teenagers in the van. Police say they have been apprehended. They are looking for the driver tonight. A Milwaukee police officer says he does not believe any of their injuries were life threatening. Right after the crash, dozens of witnesses actually ran toward this scene to help free a teenager that was trapped inside. Micaiah Bell sent us this video he took after he and others helped lift that car before firefighters were forced to cut open the vehicle and pull that boy out. So uh, I got out, I tried to uh, help and I used my weight and my strength to push the truck up that had flipped and, you know, we held it, I held it up there until the first responders came. And Bell says his thoughts are with the folks injured in this crash, but he said he and several of his neighbors have almost become accustomed to reckless driving here on the south side. Now, Milwaukee police say the driver of that stolen minivan fled the scene. They are considered a person of interest in this case. When we get more information on what happened and who's responsible, we will bring that to you. We're live tonight at the intersection of 11th and Madison. Sam Kramer, Fox 6 News. Left the others behind. All right, Sam, thank you.